Hi everyone, welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. Here the question: Which is the most inferior anterior aortic branch? So it is one of the direct question that the which is the most inferior anterior aortic branch. So here, first of all, we have to find out the anterior aortic branch. Then uh, it will be very easy for us that which artery or which branch is the most inferior but anteriorly located. Here are the options. The options are median sacral artery, inferior mesenteric artery, lumbar artery, superior mesenteric artery, and gonadal artery. So we have to find out one of the branch which is located anterior or which is the anterior aortic branch but it is most inferiorly placed so it is very very easy and we can see this here in the first picture this tree is the anterior aortic branch and here we can see this is the diaphragm and this is the anterior part and here the terminal part of the abdominal aorta and the terminal branch are right common iliac artery and left common iliac artery and we can see first of all anterior superior structure is the or branch is the celiac trunk then superior mesenteric artery it is the second inferior uh, anterior abdominal uh, branch of the outer then we can see this is the most inferior but anterior structure and this is the inferior mesenteric artery so it is now clear that the inferior mesenteric artery this inferior mesenteric artery is the most inferiorly located anterior branch of the abdominal aorta and in the second picture we also can see this is the first here is the second and here is the third branch and we know the anterior branch they are totally in three one is the celiac axis or celiac trunk then superior mesenteric artery and then inferior mesenteric artery so the inferior mesenteric artery it is the most inferiorly placed anterior branch of the abdominal aorta and here this is the terminal branch so these two type of the branch is already finished then another two types of the branches are present one is the lateral branch and another one is the posterior branch and we know that posterior there are two types of the arteries one group is the lumbar arteries there are four pair, pairs and you can see lumbar one lumbar two lumbar three and lumbar four and it is the median sacral artery so these two types are the posterior branch of the abdominal aorta so here they are the posterior branch in the uh, second picture we also can see this is the median sacral artery it is the posterior branch and the lumbar artery here we can see lumbar one lumbar two lumbar three and lumbar four so they are the posterior branch of the abdominal aorta here the lumbar arteries we can see the lumbar arteries they are four pairs in numbers and median sacral arteries and some other lateral branches lateral branches here uh, such as the inferior phrenic middle suprarenal renal and gonadal so these four are the lateral branches of the abdominal aorta so here left phrenic artery or phrenic artery middle suprarenal renal and gonadal they are the lateral branch so this is all about the abdominal aorta and here we can see also there is first of all this is the celiac trunk here superior mesenteric artery and inferior mesenteric artery and this inferior mesenteric artery is the anterior branch of the abdominal aorta but it is the most inferiorly placed so it is now ready that the inferior inferior mesenteric artery this inferior uh, inferior mesenteric artery is the most inferior anterior aortic branch and here we can see the branches of the abdominal aorta here we can see this is the inferior pharynx celiac tract superior mesenteric artery median suprarenal renal gonadal lumbar inferior mesenteric medial sacral and common iliac so they are the branches of the aorta and other structure here such as the median sacral artery it is the posterior branch lumbar arteries they are posterior branch superior mesenteric artery it is anterior branch but lies above then gonadal artery it is the lateral branch 